Hi guys, it's Knife here, and today I want to show you um, a little in a little closer detail uh, a planner I got today. Um, now it did not come with these rings; it did come with the classic rings, the plastic um, see-through pink uh, rings, and I bought the metal rings at Hobby Lobby, um, and they're expander rings. Because um, as you can see, this is the regular size. Well, actually, here, let me show you. Let's put that over there. But this is the ring that it came with, and then this is the expander ring. So you can see, and then this is the ring for the mini. So you can see the different, you know, some of the different comparisons to the size. And I always buy, well, not always, but a lot of the times I buy expander rings. Or like if it's a mini, um... I bought classic rings for my mini um, just because I like to add stuff, which is why using a happy planner is wonderful. So, but this is a faith planner. This is the um, classic spring floral faith. So this is going to be my faith planner for 2020. Um, I, I was going to get the Psalms one and then... I saw this one, and I like this one a lot more, and I'll show you why in a minute. So I'm just going to kind of take you through, show you what the um, the layouts look like, and then I'm going to show you the uh, dividers. So in case if you were looking for a um, faith planner and you didn't really care for the Psalms, that you, you know there's another um, choice. And I got this at Hobby Lobby, so I got 40% off of it. Um, so yeah, but this says, um, in, I think this is rose gold, um, but it says grace for today. Um, so yeah, and I'm not really usually a floral person, but this one is kind of the muted tones a little bit and it's, I don't know. I just, I loved, I loved this planner. So anyway, so you open it up and I, I've already, you know, opened it and cause I put my rings on and everything. Um, and that's what the inside looks like. It's just very pale pink dots. All right, so you have your opening page as always. Oh, and then it did come with the, you know, the welcome that all the planners. I just always stick my stuff in the back um, because I do not have a planner punch. So what I do is I will take this out uh, and I will punch it with just a regular hole punch. And then I'll take my scissors and I'll cut. And so I use this for my hole placement um, because it's better to use this, which I don't mind if this gets messed up. Um... You know, and then plus I can remember, you know, what it was called, how much it was, and things like that. So I always put my, all my stuff in the back. That's just a me thing. I don't know. Eh. Okay. So anyway, so this is the, um, and sorry for Christopher in the background, guys. He is singing and he's singing all kinds of YouTube songs and he's just singing at the top of his lungs having his best life, but, you know, it does kind of, he does get loud. My door is, bedroom door is closed, but he's just loud. So, but anyway, this, it says, praise the Lord. This happy planner of faith edition belongs to, and then, um, I'm going to put my name here and then it says plan a happy life 2020. All right. So you open it up and there's the calendar, the, the, um, 2020 and the 2021. Um, I like how the, it's in script up here. It's really pretty. And so you can see that. Um, then you have your pages with your, um, all the days, you know, for the whole year, the days just, uh, and there's a lot of things. Um, I watch Kel of a plan. I love her videos and she has a whole video on 50 different things that you can do with these. Um, for this one, I'm not sure what I'm going to do with this yet. Um, I'm not going to sure if I'm just going to do an extra verse of the day, if I'm going to write maybe a positive something, um, I don't know yet. Maybe somebody special that I need to pray for that day. I'm just not sure exactly what I'm going to use this for, but if you have any ideas, which would be great for in a faith planner for this, let me know down below. So this is for January. You can barely see. 
See, it says January, really, really, because it's on the pale peach, and it just says January and white. And then you have all this list. Now, this list, I think, is the same everywhere um, on, e on each month, but it's opportunity to serve. So you can write down, you know, maybe something a church is going to have or, uh, you know, a friend that's in need or something like that. Um, rejoicing in, blessed by, where my heart is, trusting God in, finding hope in, Learning to be patient with, that's a good one. Uh, simple joy, I need extra help too. Worship song I'm singing, that's a great one for me, but I need more lines. Um, asking God for courage too. Seeing God's hand in. Answered prayer and someone to encourage. Um, and then down here, it's just notes, thoughts, gratitude. Um, so you have a space for that. And then for your January, you have this gorgeous... Um, floral and it says don't let your heart be troubled john 14 1 i thought so isn't that beautiful um then you have your monthly view um and then you know you have your space to write here on the side for whatever you want to write um and then it starts um on your weekly now you have your prayer list over here. Um, now this is the whole reason right here that I decided to get this one instead of the um, Psalms planner. It has daily dis disciplines. It has prayer and your ch ch you know your little tracker. It has scripture reading. It has your little tracker, and then it has a blank one right here. Now um, since I'm Mormon, I'm going to cover these crosses because uh, that's not something that we do. Um, but that's okay. It's small enough. I can cover it with a sticker or some washi tape or whatever. Uh, and then this uses the soap mesh method, which is scripture, observation, application, and then prayer over here. So, so I can um, take each day because this is vertical. So I can take each day. I can write down what my scripture is. Um, then I can write um, keywords. Uh, I can write an observation about it and then how I can apply it. Um, in my life. So every single um, month has this for every day. Okay. So this is the same. It looks just like this. It doesn't change through the whole entire planner. Uh, now I think I'm going to buy or make some inserts um, or just some paper so I can stick a piece of paper in, e you know, in each week and write down um, my sacrament notes, my notes for um, either Sunday school or Relief Society, which is what women go to in our in in the mormon um religion we um we either go it's every other week we women go to relief society and men go to priesthood and it's just a great way to fellowship um with our sisters um and then we also have sunday school so yeah so i want to do my notes and so i need extra paper to do that um, and then it starts all over again and it's the same, it's the same, um, writing over here. So, um, we have this next, uh, insert with the rose gold for February. Uh, and it says love is patient and is kind. Love doesn't envy. Love doesn't brag, is not proud, doesn't behave itself inappropriately, doesn't seek its own way, is not provoked, takes no account of evil, doesn't rejoice in unrighteousness but rejoices with the truth, bears all things, believes all things, hopes all things, and endures all things. Love never fails. And that's 1 Corinthians 13, 4 through 8. Love that. And it's just, it's the, um, I think that's, I think that's rose gold foil. Sometimes it's hard to tell. Okay, then we have March. Oh, don't you just love that color, that, that purple, that deep purple, um, and then we have April, which is this one. And it says, therefore, exhort one another and build each other up. And that's 1 Thessalonians 5.11. I probably pronounced that wrong. Um, but yeah. Uh, then we have May. <gasps> oh, look at that pretty, that pretty teal color. It says, she believed he could, so she prayed. That is wonderful. I love that one. That's for May. Then we have June, which is just the the floral. 
and then we have July. These rings seem really big now, guys, but by the time I put my um, different things in here that I want to put in here, it'll fill up really fast because um, I add a lot of stuff to my planner, and I like keeping my whole planner. I know that a lot of people Franken-plan, and they'll put like a month from this and a month from that. I don't do that. I like my separate planners. I'm weird that way. Um, and this is Grace today, with that beautiful purple. I just love that. Um, so yeah, I'll keep this together, um, but I will add sheets to it and add some things. Um, not sure exactly all of what I'm going to add yet, but yeah. Uh, it says, we love others best when we love God first. That's nice, too. And then September, which is my birth month. Um, he makes all things new again. So that's in that center. And it's like got a frame around it. It's really pretty. October is true happiness blooms from the heart. Isn't that gorgeous? And that it's got that purple, that deep purple again. And then November, which to me looks like Thanksgiving colors and just gorgeous. And it's hard to see, but the writing's over here. And it says, in everything, give thanks. And that's one Theologians. That, that's 518. That's that one I can't say again. <laughs> um, but that's just so gorgeous. And the peaches and the brown. It's just, it's to me, it, it screams Thanksgiving. And then this one, which I think is perfect for December, for Christmas. Um, it says, in your presence is fullness of joy and that's psalms 1611 and then the very last page is it always is um well it usually is notes but this one is special prayers so you can keep a list of special prayers back here so yeah but oh, oh and then another thing that this one has that i absolutely love is it actually has a verse back here and it says my grace is sufficient for you for my power is made perfect in weakness and that's second corinthians 12 9 so I just think um, that this is a great um, faith planner for me. Uh, like I said, I did like the colors of the Psalms planner, um, but it just, it didn't quite work for me because I, I am trying to keep track of my praying every day because I am not the best at that. And then I'm trying to read my scriptures every day, not the best at that either. And so if I have to check a box, it makes me um, do that. So, and then I bought, um, hold on one second. I bought this paper and this paper, um, to do something with. I'm not sure if I'm going to make a folder. Um, I think one of them I'm going to make, a cause I always do it today. Like for my social media slash, um, I don't mind the pink color, but I see, I have a today where it's this week, um, and this is my, this is the one I keep, this is my unicorn one, pretty, um, but this is the one, this was an 18 month planner, so this is where I keep track of my reading, um, right now I'm keeping track of, I'm reading in the Book of Mormon, I'm keeping track of what I'm reading, um, I do my films, so that's, these are the two I filmed, as soon as this one's over, I'll write that down, um, I keep track of what I've read and how many pages, um, so this, and, but see, this is, is still on the classic discs, because I'm not going to add anything else to this one. This is enough um, for this, for what I want to use for this. Um, but I'm I'm thinking instead of doing this, which I did this with glitter, and I like it okay, um, but I think I want to use, cut this one, like cut it, and then use this for my bookmark for this planner. And I haven't decided what I'm going to do with this, but these two just looked so... I mean, the colors just match so wonderfully, and it was only a quarter a piece, so, you know. Anyway, guys, I'm rambling, um, but I just want to, sorry, I just wanted to share with you um, that planner, because I hadn't seen it um, from anywhere, uh, and if you're like me and want it, we're looking to get a faith planner, then, you know, that you do have two options. Um, and this one is at Hobby Lobby. And actually, they had the Psalms one at Hobby Lobby. And the Psalms one comes in the mini also. So you have that choice too. Um, just for me with the scripture and the way I write and stuff, um, the observations, I'm kind of long-winded. So I knew I was going to need space. So I got this one. So, but yeah. Anyway, um, thank you so much guys for watching. Um, let me know if um, you use a happy planner or if you have been thinking about it or if you just 
you know, don't plan at all. <laughs> um, if you don't plan at all, thank you so much for watching anyway. Uh, please remember to always be kind to one another, and I'll see you again in the next video. Bye!